In this TA Tech Tip, we will show how analyzing data in an overlay graph is an easy and effective way to analyze multiple curves. Analyzing within an overlay makes it easy to repeat analyses using identical limits, a key factor in maximizing the repeatability of your measurements. I have here a set of replicate India melts, a typical experiment we use for verifying the performance of a DSC. I'm going to create an overlay document by going to the Home ribbon, click right here, and then click New Overlay Document right here. Now I have a new overlay document. It's a standalone TRIOS document. It can be saved just like any other file. And you can easily move experiments to an overlay document. Simply go to your file manager, click on the file, and drag it over. OK, now go to the next file, drag it over. OK, you can select multiple files. Just hold down the Shift key, select the files, and drag them over. OK, it's as easy as that. If you um, just want to rescale it a little bit with a zoom box, OK, this will show you how you've zoomed in. You can close that down by um, clicking right there. So now I have my plot. I have my legend here. It shows the multiple curves. Um, you can select the curve by selecting the legend itself. Okay. So now I'm going to go to my analysis um, ribbon. I'm going to select peak integration enthalpy and say select limits. So now I've got my limits here. I can move my cursors wherever I want. I'm going to move it to right about there and right about, right about there. Okay. So I like that spot. Now I'm going to just right click and say accept limits. Okay? And when I want to do the next curve, I just select the curve in the legend, say set limits, and you notice it goes right back to the same spot. That's what you want. Okay? So you just click on the curve in the legend, say set limits, and then right click and say accept. Okay? That's all you have to do. I'm analyzing five curves now, and I'm using the exact same limits. Okay? That's the key to getting repeatable measurements is to use the same limits. Okay, so now these are just these are just labels on a plot. I can move them around any which way I want. I can generate a plot just like we always did. And that's really what we've always done. Now we have an overlay document that contains multiple curves with multiple analysis labels displayed on the graph. So it is fast and easy to complete multiple analyses in an overlay, and using identical limits improves your repeatability in the process. But at this point, these results are just labels on a graph. To get these results into a more useful format for further analysis, we have created Analysis Reports, a new feature in TRIOS that makes it easy and effective to analyze results.